Hard hit back up the middle. That's going to drive in a run. And Murray's going to stop it first. There it is. We tie the game up. And this is almost like a playoff game for us. Given the fact that we're down four and a half games of the wild card, we have got to win every game if we're going to have a chance to sneak into the wild card. Take a look at Murray putting this back up in the middle. You can hear the crowd going wild. Hey, what's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to another episode of Road to the Show with Kyler Murray. As you know, we are closing in on the end of the season, and we are, I mean, not getting any closer to the Mariners. But look at this. Actually, I mean, we are getting closer to the Mariners, but we're four and a half games back of the wild card. We still have a shot at this. We still have a shot. I mean, Tigers, no. White and Sox, no. But we could catch up to the Blue Jays. We're four and a half games back. Um, they just lost a game. They're four and six of their last ten, and we're eight and two. Do we keep this trend going? We have a chance. We really do. I, I, I hope that we can close the gap here, sneak in to the wild card. It's possible, but we don't have many games left. Is it possible? We got to keep winning like we're doing. And we got to hope that the Blue Jays struggle. We do have more games against the White Sox. I don't know. Maybe Can we make it? Is it, is it, is it possible? It must be because otherwise these teams would have clinched, right? Uh, White Sox, they're a little bit better, but does beating the White Sox help us any? Really, I wonder who the Blue Jays play, man. I hope that. Can you change? No. Blue Jays. Blue Jays. Blue Jays. Blue Jays. Blue Jays. Hey, the Dodgers. Are they any good? They're 90 to 63. Boston. They still have Boston left. 6, 76, 76. And then the White Sox. There's a shot. There's a shot that we can. Uh, there's a shot that we can do this. I don't know. I don't know. We'll have to see. Let's. What, what can we work on here? Stealing and speed. Look, I have a cat hair in my on my tongue. I don't want to actually do anything. And so I guess we'll work on, uh, we'll work on this. And here we go. We're going up against the White Sox who are, look at this, man. They're really good. So we got to play some really good baseball. They, uh, they are hot. Wow. They're hot. It makes me a little nervous. Really does. So let's see. Let's see what we can do. Because I'm a little nervous now. Being that they're they're playing so good right now. White Sox. Hmm. So. Hmm, look at this. Hey, wild card. We're right there, man. Right there, four and a half games back. Eight and two in our last 10. I mean, it's right there. It's there as far as the ticket. We just gotta reach out and grab it like this. Boom, you know? But this is gonna be a tough matchup. Tough matchup. We got Owen Lowry on the mound. He is a six and 10 uh, with a 3.86 ERA through 179 and one a third innings pitched. Andrew Vaughn starting things off. Well, not really starting things off here, but they got two men on base, two away, and he's up to the plate in the five hole. This one's going to be... I mean, we got a crowd here cheering the athletics on, hoping that we can pull a victory away. We got to have a good game by Kyler Murray. A good series by Kyler Murray. Garcia, Elliott, and Bichette are due up. Followed by Murray, so we can get somebody on base. We'll be, we'll be uh, trucking it with two outs. Batting four. 
And there we are, two outs. Man on first base, probably Bichette. Dude's always on base. Dude is on base so often. Davis Martin on the mound. Gonna foul away the circle change. It's 0-1 count. Man, that's not a good start. 0-2 count. Davis Martin on the delivery. Outside for a ball brings us to a one and two. He doesn't throw me a strike. Oh, we were on top of it. And they're going to get the easy play over at second base for the third out. Man. Really, really thought we could make something out of that. Do up Rogers, Freeman, and Thomas. We see Brendan Rogers up to the plate, top of the second, but no outs. He was a 2024 All Star. I think 265 this year. And this is shallow hit. Murray there. We got to have a good defensive game, too. So, oh, here we are. Chicago White Sox have taken the a lead, but we have two men on base. Two outs in the bottom of the third. First pitch, low and away for a ball. 1-0 and oh now. Tyler Murray, sixth in the AL and RBIs with 109. Hard hit back up the middle. That's going to drive in a run. And Murray's going to stop it first. There it is. We tie the game up. And this is almost like a playoff game for us. Given the fact that we're down four and a half games of the wild card, we have got to win every game if we're going to have a chance to sneak into the wild card. Take a look at Murray putting this back up the middle. You can hear the crowd going wild. They are excited. They want to see these athletics make it to the playoffs. And Oakland in the lead 2-1 to one in the top of the fifth. The man on first. Robert Jr. Up to the play. I feel like we just went up against Robert Lewis Robert Jr. So, top of the fifth. Oh, no. The White Sox take the lead again. Four to two. And they have two men on, but two away. Hard hit back up the middle. That's going to be a base hit. And may drive in a run. Murray. It's going to get cut off. And no, they're going to say he's safe. And it's now five to two. If we lose this series, I don't know if we can make it to the playoffs. Five to two. Lane Thomas up over two today with two strikeouts. It's only the top of the fifth. And they still have two men on base. I don't know. Shallow hit. Murray's not going to get there in time. They're going to score another run. Eduardo Rodriguez on the mound. We may have to get this guy out of here. As it's now 6-2. to two And Oakland put, or uh, the White Sox putting on a clinic in the fifth inning. Andrew Benatendi up to the plate now. He's the leadoff for the White Sox. Eight to two. This game is uh, start has definitely got out of hand. It is still the eighth inning or fifth inning. Oh man, I had high hopes for this game and it was squashed very quickly. That is, um, and that sucks. 
Leading off. So Murray up to the plate in an 8-2 game. Bottom to six. Murray one for two with a single and an RBI. Fortunately, the pitching has just fallen flat in this game. Doesn't mean the game's over, but it's going to be a hard one to come back on with six runs down. Woo! A high heater. Murray swings through it. A little late on it. Davis Martin's, Martin's still on the mound. Taking that one outside. One and one is the count now. Hey, your pitch. All in the way, the inside pitch should have been a ball, but Murray swings at it, fouls it away. All right, one time, right here. Ooh. One, two count. Hanging in there. Look at this. He hasn't thrown me a strike, man. Two balls, two strikes. Come on, two, two count now. Murray waiting for a good pitch. Fouling away some stuff. Hard hit to right field. That might have the distance, but it's going to be short. And that's going to be one away in the bottom of the six. Up next, next. Oh, oh. the third base. We got bases loaded. We are down by six. So the grand slam won't get us all the way there, but it'll get us close. Jimmy Lambert on the mound now. Oh, what a snag by the third baseman. And he prevents one, maybe two runs from scoring. And that definitely was going to be two. Tyler Freeman coming up with a big play down the third base line. But the snag and the throw over to first. Wow. And if we could have scored runs right there. Bottom of the ninth, down by four. We put some runs on the board. Lambert still on the mound. Two balls, no strike. Two O count. Oh, that was a ball in it. Yeah, that circle change got me. Two one, two away. All comes down to this. Whoa! He calls it a strike. Two two now. We are down to the last out. Is it back up the middle, but that should be an easy routine fly ball for the center fielder and the Chicago White Sox takes game one in this three game series. And that's going to be a difficult hole to climb out of. We can only hope that the Blue Jays continue their losing ways as they got a lot of catching up to do. We have to win the next two games. I mean, I, I think, I don't know. Right? I mean, really, we win five games and the Blue Jays lose five. We're tied. And then it's a matter of what happens after that. We'd be more than tied. We'd actually be up a half a game. With that loss, we have to assume that the Blue Jays won. So now five and a half games. I, I think, right? If I'm doing my math right. We'll see. We'll see when it's all said and done. Jonathan Diaz, two starts with a one and one record on this season. 4.5 ERA through 12 innings. He's given up 12 hits, zero walks, and 12 strikeouts. That's a one on the whip. Hasn't had as much action this year as he did last year. And they already have a man on first base, one away. Oh. 
And they're going to send this guy over to third. It's going to be easy play for them. They got runners on the corners now. We should definitely, we, we can't stop. I mean, they are a good hitting team. They already have two runs on the board. Already have two runs on the board. Hmm. Come on, Woo! One. one link out, one. bottom of the second. Nobody on and nobody out. Casey Mize on the mound. Ooh, sinker got me. Jam me. Surprised it didn't break the bat. And that's got to be a pop out to the center field. All right, so the third base. Man. We're losing four to two, huh? Bottom of the fourth. We got two men on base though. Hey, one pitch right here. Come on now. Oh. Well, at this rate, I don't see us making it to the playoffs if we're gonna have to face. Let's go. We had to face the White Sox four more times after this game. Popped it up, I think. Yeah. Man. Now Third Gotta get something going. Gotta get something going. Robert Jr. out in center field with the catch. Six to three. Come on. We just can't get. I mean, they are scoring so many runs. Okay, let's just let's start by getting on base, right? Bottom of the sixth. Seems like they get good pitching too, man. There it is. You better hustle. You better hustle, Murray. You better hustle, Murray. Ooh, that was close. There we go. We got a little rally going now. Got a little rally. No out rally. Let's take another look at this one right down the line. Perfect, perfect. Coming up to in that almost hit the foul hole there. Rolled up to the foul pole. And get in just in time for a double. It doesn't matter. We don't score runs, but they do. Where's where's our pitching? I hope they invest in some pitching in the offseason. But clearly, we need it. Bottom of the ninth now. The sinker got me. The sinker got me. Now, third base. Man, that's not good for us, right? I mean, is there a, a, a do we? I it really just depends on what the Blue Jays are doing, I guess. We can hope the Blue Jays are losing. We have three series left. I think we have three series after this. I know the Dodgers and the White Sox, and then one more, I think. Can't remember. Is it the, not the, is it the Yankees or it might be Red Sox? But that's uh, three, six, nine, like nine games. Nine or ten games, depending on if it's a four game series in there. But so if we get down by. So where's the turning point? You know? Nine. I mean, we get over more than five games down. I would think that would. Huh? I don't know. I don't know. Math, uh, math, uh, evades me on all that. The top of the first in game three. We do have our best pitcher on the mound, so we have a chance. 
And we at least get the first out. There we are. Oakland in the lead. Look at this. Look at this. I would like to extend that lead right here. Chris Paddock on the mound for the White Sox. Ooh, he swings at that low fastball out in front of it. And it is fouled away. Hard hit. In between the shortstop and third baseman. That's going to be an easy base hit. And a two-way, Murray is on base. The third baseman. We tied this thing up. Man, White Sox just score runs. That's just what they do. They may win the World Series with the way they're playing right now. I mean, they are hot. And on second. Tie ball game, bottom of the third. Ooh, you better be glad I was out in front of that one, boy. Oh, my gosh. Pulls that one foul. No! Man. <sighs> All right, they got Dames, Vaughn, and Rogers. Two up next. See how many runs they score this time. Oh, still tied up. He had a solo home run in the, the, the third. Well, they scored their other run. There it is. So first out in the top of the sixth and Murray coming up to the plate again. One for two. Nobody on and nobody out. Crowd is going wild for sure. Oh, he keeps throwing me the curveball. And I can I'm hitting it hard, but. And he threw that one down the middle too. Oh, we're winning seven to two and we got the bases loaded. Are you kidding me? I'm swinging for the fence. Let's put this game so far out of reach. I mean, they just, they can't even. We're still in this bottom of the six. Jimmy Lambert on the mound now. So we've scored five runs. Plus we have uh, three on base and I've been only out. That's five, six, seven, eight. I'm nine, man. Uh, I'm gonna be both outs. I got all three outs in that inning. Oh, we did score five. All five outs. I mean, all three outs. Look at this. It hit it in. I uh. Got the first out of the inning, and then I hit it into a double play. Now back, the first base, Andrew Vaughn. So top of the eighth, they, have, they managed to put two more runs on the board. They put two runs like every inning. Almost. I mean, they're really good at putting two runs on the board. They really are. The so one away in the top of the eight. Five more outs to get. Brendan Rogers, 0 for 2 with a walk and a run scored. Full count. They're down by three. Oakland up by three. That's going to be a base hit. Let's hope it doesn't start a rally. Up next to the White Sox. The third baseman, Tyler Freeman. Okay. Now 10 to 4. Fielder, 10 to 4. Here we go. Bottom of the eighth, man on second. Hard hit down the line, and that's going to be another base hit for Kyler Murray. This one down the line, just like his first base hit. 
That's going to score another run. And the wild throw is second. But them come in safely to second. That's his 44th RBI of the season. And Oakland, after losing the first two games in this series, are putting a whooping on the White Sox in this game. It's now 11 to 4. Now that's going to be the final. The Oakland dropped two, but they win one. We'll just have to see how the standings look after this. Again, trying to make that wild card. Hopefully, the Blue Jays are going to continue to uh, play their slumping ways. White Sox do win this series 2 to 1 after dropping this game 11 to 4. Ladies and gentlemen, with that being said, that's going to be it for this episode. We will check the standings first thing in the next uh, Road to the Show episode. If you enjoyed it, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel and you like the content and you, you're, you're, you're right here with us trying to make a late push to get that last wild card spot, go ahead and hit the subscribe button so you can watch and see how this turns out. Otherwise, we'll be going into next season. I don't know. We'll see. Anyways, guys, until next time, y'all have a good one. Peace.